Welcome back to Live Minded Video. Today we have an exciting tutorial. We'll show you how to make stunning animated graphics using Canva and seamlessly integrate them into a popular live streaming software like OBS, but it also could be used in Ecamm or vMix or just playing into your video. Let's check it out. Here we are in Canva. First thing we need to do is go to the right side, click on create a design, go to video 1910 by 1080. Now in the left, select elements. I'm just going to grab this one today because that's one I used. But the beauty here is that you can select any animated graphics and pull it over to the Canva on the right side. Now we select background color. We'll select green. That's going to be important because of the chroma key we'll need in OBS. Click share, download, make sure it's MP4 video and then I'll go straight to my download folder. Now in our download folder, we'll click on MP4 video just to make sure it runs. And then we'll go ahead and head over to the download folder, like I said, and we're gonna go ahead and rename it so we'll know where it is. Once we head over to the very important step here, which is heading over to the Cloud Convert website, which will do our conversion. I'll provide the link below. At the website, we'll go ahead and select the file that we just saved, which is called sub button and open it and we want to convert it to webm very important and then we'll convert once it uploads it'll go to our download fo folder again and then we'll go ahead and open obs obs is on my desktop go ahead and click it it'll open you'll notice i've already input the file but let me show you how to do it again we'll just click on the plus sign then select media source in this case it's media source 2 you can rename it, whatever you like, because this is the sub button. Then we'll go ahead and add a chroma key. As you can see, you can leave it as default or start to customize it. But at this point, it looks very good at default settings. So then I'll go ahead and close it. And believe it or not, we are almost at the finish line. Start creating scenes and including images or lower thirds or display captures. And you have yourself animated graphics within Canva that is imported seamlessly into OBS. As you can see here, I've created many scenes. And in those scenes, we include lower thirds, we include images, we included our media source, which is what we created in Canva. I'll go ahead and customize it and to put it to the lower left. I can add my display image from my iPhone. I can get rid of the images. I can put whatever I'd like within this scene. And that's what makes this an incredible conversion because whatever you need to do in Canva, you can bring it over into OBS. Hope you enjoyed this tutorial. Once again, this is Live Minded Video. Please like and subscribe and I'll see you in the next video.